hello, everybody. It's nice to see you. Um, I guess it's the first time I'll ever say hello. My name is Rina, and this is my first ever video. I'm excited, so I thought I'd do something special and do a small little game I found on Steam called Boo Dunu. I don't really know much about it except that you're a ghost detective, which is really fun sounding. And this song at the beginning makes me want to sing a little song. Maybe I'll add an extra out as a bloopers at the end of this video. If I feel uh, confident enough to do that. Okay, let's start. Boolia is a ghost. Maybe this information will help you. <laughs> uh, maybe. Welcome to the afterlife. We do hope you enjoy yourself. Press WAS to navigate. Okay, move the mouse to rotate the camera. Press the spacebar to jump. <gasps> oh my! <laughs> I'm so cute! And I have a little flower in my head. Her name's Julia? Okay. Uh, yep. Yeah. Okay. Very simple. Aww. I'm a ghost. I don't feel like a very detective yet. Did I just die? Oh, since you passed away, you gained a number of ghostly abilities. The first one was levitation. Click the left mouse button to an object to levitate it. Move the mouse around the boot to position it. Then click left button again to release it. Objects freeze in position after you, around you after you let them go. Give it a try. Okay. Uh, yeah. They just freeze. That's handy dandy. So I need to probably build something, right? Press shift to dash to thin surface like fences. But are you sure you want to go that way? That way leads back to Earth. Yes. I want to go back to Earth. I have your choice, I guess. You're only missing out on eternal peace. Levitate and stack these boxes to jump over the wall. Well, I mean, when you... <laughs> when you... <laughs> Say it like that, I kind of feel bad. I, I kind of want internal peace too, but maybe I need to solve my murder or something. Eh, is that good? Oh, ah, yeah, almost. It's a little lower. And that's too good, right? Nope. Not really good at these. It's, how do I make it lower? Oh, there you go. Like that. Hello. Sure hope you know what you're doing. I do. Try combining jumping, levitation, and dash to get to new areas. I know exactly what I'm doing. Besides, I have a little scarf. How can I not? Press the space bar and levitate and dash. Okay. Oh! <laughs> that was a bit much. last riddle before you can turn to earth. You have to use jumping, levitation, dash as best as possible. Good luck. Okay. The controls are a bit, a little bit, I guess floaty, but I think that's on purpose because I'm a ghost. Maybe not floaty, they feel kind of heavy for a ghost. Spacebar and dash and levitate. Okay. Oh, and time that night. But it's like a little indie game, so I shouldn't fault them for anything. This is just for fun, please. It's free, by the by, so if anyone wants to play it themselves, I have linked it in the description below. So let's see. Yep. Well, good job! Completing the tutorial. You're now ready to return to Earth. Maybe you'll find more peace there. It's next to continue. Go nuts, but not walnuts. Emmy's allergic to those. <gasps> is that my new friend? Oh, Julia Lawson. So, her name's Julia? So, you've finally awakened. Took you long enough. Can I skip? Sorry, I'm not exactly known for my manners. Yeah, you look a bit grumpy. 
My name is Sir Bartholomew Bunkle. <laughs> but you can call me Sir Bun Bunkle for short. Now, this might come as a shock to you, but you've been murdered, Julia. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great way to wake up. The whole town's in an uproar about it. But since the circumstances are still unknown, you're not gonna go just yet. The unfinished business of yours is where I come in. Okay. I can help you escape the cemetery so you can find your grieving sister, Emmy. I will tell you more along the way, as long as you press F to talk, that is. Now, shall we? Of course. Can I... Takes, oh, I can level take. I shouldn't do that. It's disturbing my own grave. I press F. Okay. I can just jump that though. Boonkle? Boonkle? Come. Boonkle? Do I. Boonkle? I'm pressing F. Boonkle, do you not like me? Boonkle. Boonkle? You know what? Fine. I don't need you. Oh. Okay. Boonkle? These walls are probably too thick for you to dash. I wish I could help you, but it looks like you'll have to find another way through. Oh, and in case you're wondering why you can't fly or teleport, let's just say... It took me half a century to master it. Tough luck to you, ghostly novice. <laughs> you're rude. Okay. Maybe I can just smash it? Sorry, I'm not using my own candle, but yours. That's not a smash. Okay. Fine. Wait, I can just move it. Doing. Yeah, breaking it apart. Okay, that's not as lit. that's not what I thought about. Maybe move it. Yeah. Ow. Yeah, just move it. There. Clean this up. Move the candle. You're not getting that back, sir. <laughs> okay, I'm through. Yay! Oh, someone left. Oh, a rabbit. That's sad. When, oh, oh, I became so obsessed with wealth that I completely neg neglected the welfare of the residents. So you were like the mayor? I turned my back in town. I found never helping those who needed me. That's why I'm the same form as you. I need to help someone for a change. It looks like that someone is you, Julia. Or should I say, Boolia? <laughs> oh, the puns are so disgusting. <laughs> Uh, okay, what should I do? I could probably. Is that a bug? I can talk to it? Can I talk to you? Why do you have a happy face? I'll levitate. I can't. Okay? I'm not talking to you yet. Ooh, under construction. Can I see? Nope. Mm, ghost butt. What's in here? This looks pretty. Oh, I can shift. Come on, shift. I can only shift where it wants me to. Okay. As a ghost, you can possess other living beings. Not including me, of course, just people and animals. Animals have a unique special ability you can use. Rats, for example, can climb on vines. Press E to possess or unpossess and press Q to use a special ability. Okay. Hmm. So, E. I'm a rat! Can I... Oh, you can climb on vines. Right. That's mildly disturbing. <laughs> uh, I forgot. Shoot. Uh huh. Hold on. I need to do something. Okay. Am I gonna... Can I go... Oh, oh. Alright. Uh... Good. Good job. You're almost at the entrance. Yes, almost, since there are still people blocking to get over there. You need to possess and move them, or scare them with the same rat you just used. When possessing him, you can talk to others by pressing F as well. I want to possess them. I want to see what they have to say. Nice. Can I talk to you? Nope. I'm just trying to... Yeah, they kind of look the same. I like his shirt better though. So I'll possess you. Hello. Hey. There my baby. <laughs> Big bro. 
what's on your mind? Where are we? We're on um, the cemetery. Julia died yesterday. I miss her already. She was so great to talk to. Always down for a good prank. Remember the one with the catapult in the manure? That we shot at your house? Oh, that was unforgettable. I think we permanently lowered the property value. <laughs> Why are you proud of that? We did help clean it up, though. All good pranksters have to walk the walk as well. Yeah, I admire that. But you know, Julia's not with us anymore. Her sister just came into town recently as well. She must be having a bad time. Who are you? What? Are you playing my leg? It's not very funny. You might be hearing my things as we speak. No! It's me, Bort, the cooler twin. <laughs> Funny you too. Sorry, I gotta go. Okay, talk to you later, big bro. I can't believe he <laughs> uses hex lingo in real life. That means see you later. Oh, please, no, please. <laughs> don't do that. Don't, don't say that. <laughs> Can I open the door? Can I open the door? I'll just move you. Right here. Yeah, Bort, go over there, and then I'm going to possess you. Well, do you see anything different than your brother? Oh, hello, Bort. Your name is Bert. Bort, that's so hurtful. Please don't joke around like that. Saying they don't even remember your own twin brother. It's cruelly for you. I liked your other pranks better. So, is there any difference? Still confused. Are you okay? Maybe you're getting forgetful in your old age. <laughs> Uh, she used to probably play your pranks, the pranks you played on me, to be clear. You really knocked it out of the park with the water balloon. I thought it was dry, and then suddenly it wasn't crazy how it goes. That's... <laughs> what is that? How? How? Did he just do magic? But deadly Julia passed away yesterday. Cops are still trying to figure out what happened. Is there really to learn about it? Oh, The love for these brothers. So, just stand there. No, stop talking. Start. No. no. Okay. Let me just unpossess. Here, you you guys keep talking to each other like good brothers. Aw, is that my sister? I love you, sis. Yeah, you must be my sister. I want to talk to my sister. Emmy? Where did I go? Well, oh, no! Leave me alone, please. I, I... Julia, is that you? But how? I thought you were... I saw you at our flower shop. You were... I'm sorry. It's just I wish I could have been there for you. Why do you look like that anyway? I've been murdered. I need your help, sister. I know you were... Wait, murdered? You don't mean that, do you? What, what other murder is there? <laughs> the police haven't confirmed anything like that so far. But hearing it from you, who am I not to believe it? Still, is this really you? Sorry, I just can't think straight right now. Julia, I don't want you to go. But if it means we can be together again, then I'll help you. The first place to look around would be the flower shop or the town square. Stay close to me, okay? Aww. That's so sad. This real love is such a wonderful thing. Can I keep talking to you? No need to mourn. Oh. Like it says the same thing. Uh, I went most fault with business. Yeah. It's the same. Oh, she's allergic to- Oh, the sisters are in there! Ah! Oh, death is such a harsh thing. Mostly for those that are still alive. This is so pretty though. I love the colors. Harder are us. Oh, this place is like, what? Can I float on this? No. Just ambiance. Hello, Mr. Copman. Hello. Person with glasses. Hello, sister. Just sad. I still love you though. Oh, hey, Bula. Or do you prefer Julia like old times? No, nope, Bulia. Anyway, we should talk to you. The police probably know more than us, but I doubt they're willing to talk to us. I'm a ghost. They should talk to me. Or me, rather. Can they even see you? Who do you think killed me? 
I, I don't know. I, I didn't see anyone around where I found you. Maybe we can look around for some clues. I hope she's not dead. I hope this is just like shape-shifting or something. I, I want there to be happiness. Right behind you. Aw, oh, look at these little details like the hats and like the setting sun and all the colors. It's just like walking to a painting. It's so nice. I wish I could get a hat. Can I? No. I already have a really awesome hat, so. Aw, oh, bread. Bread man. Trash can. Pigeon. You. Wait. Why is there blood? I don't trust you already. <laughs> I'm discriminating. Okay, I should probably start actually doing the story. Which is the cop man. Hi, cop man. I can't talk to you, cop man or cop woman. I guess I need a person. Maybe I, I don't really want to possess my own sister, though. That seems kind of messed up. Uh, oh, maybe if I possess a cop, they'll talk to the other cop. That makes sense. Uh, cop man? I'll be you then. Okay, where is the other cop person? Cop person? Oh, there you are. Cop person. Oh, hi, Marcus. Okay, that's her name. I mean, Chief. Yes, that's his Chief. Oh, I picked the right guy then, because he's the one who's with me. It's weird being a cop. Again, I almost forgot how it's done. Luckily, I always have my Girl Scout handbook on me to help Scout help me find clues. Do you know anything about Julian's Boutique? Not yet, I've been patrolling around town, but I haven't found anything. Oh, Julian was such a nice girl. Who could have done this? It's kind of worrisome for me that Funkle is in a crime wave all of a sudden. <laughs> We weren't. <laughs> Sorry, I'm hesitating. We weren't getting any further on tracking the elusive vent vigilante and. What? And now this? People are going to lose faith in us! Yeah, you guys suck. Things were so much better when we were on the anti littering committee. <laughs> Wait. Who are you? a bit of a weird question to ask. We've been working together for quite some time now. Oh wait, you're role playing as an inspector, right? Like in your mystery novels? I am learning so much about these people. They have such a rich lives. In that case, Inspector Marcus, I will comply to the best of my ability. Oh, he's a good friend. My name is Don. Donna? Dana? Donna. I want Dana. And I'm a full-time policewoman. At least I am now. On other days, I like to do other things, but like, I like to bake. Aww. I wasn't born in this uniform, that's for sure. No, I've always been a born and bred Girl Scout. <laughs> I can do more types of knots than there are stars in the sky. That's a lot of knots. Why would you need to do that many knots? That's kind of scary. Do not fact check that. There is no need. It's true. Well, I wasn't going to. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now I need to switch people. Dana, come over here. Let me take you over. Let me get your little feet over here. Ooh, you can. Hello, Marcus. Chief Marcus, of course. I wonder if Emmy would be willing to give us a So he wants us to. Okay. So let's see. Become him again. Ooh, you don't walk around so much, sir. It's the right button. Can I do the right button? Yep. Okay. Emmy, talk to this man. Like so. Bulia, is that you? Oh, so I can't. Uh, maybe sister? Okay, so I cannot possess. Can I possess sister? Can I? I can't. It's weird and I don't particularly like it, but okay. Hi. Oh, hi. Uh, good day. You must be Julia's sister, Emmy, right? I'm sorry for your loss. It must be awful to lose someone so close to you. Yeah, it is. I remember when my cat, <laughs> Deputy Danger, died. I mean, I'm sorry. <laughs> I cried for three weeks. Oh. That cat must have really been loved. I, uh, 
can't imagine the pain you must feel. Especially since her death was so... Forgive my worrying, but well... Very strange. We can't make heads or a tail of it just yet. After we found five clues, we'll have a saw theory on what happened. So do you know anything? Well, I'd be ringing if you shouldn't reveal it, but Chase, you never know who's listening. But even if I would want to tell you, I'm, I don't have anything to tell you. We don't know what we're dealing with at the moment. Robert might have led up on the roof, but we're not certain yet. A lead up on the roof? Oh, I probably shouldn't have said that. Don't tell anyone, okay? The roof? Okay, so roof time then. Right. Sister, roof. a rat around here? Oh yes, there is. Ha. And then I can go through here? I bet I can climb. Yeah! Ah, smart. Yeah, roof time. No! <laughs> no! Roof! Why am I... <laughs> no, I'm stuck! Oh, I'm stuck! Oh! It was so good! It's not... Oh, okay. Blast it all. Yeah! This is a pigeon. Oh, maybe I need to become the pigeon. Did the, did the rat just fly off? Uh, what is your special ability? What is it? Mm. Mm hmm. Ah, yes. Okay, so I was supposed to get over there, right? Hmm. Ah, I guess. How. supposed to get up there. Oh, I know. Let me just loop. I do. I press the button. Oh, there we go. Then that. The controls are a bit finicky sometimes, but I'm just gonna blame it on my own ineptitude. E. Okay. Um. Oh, yeah. Wait. E. Oh dear. Oh, oh dear. Okay, I'm just gonna give up on that one. Nope. Please stop. Okay. Stop doing. Uh. Yeah, that's fine. That works. That works. Oh, yeah, that works. Be right back. Go. Oh my god. Ah. Oh my god. <laughs> Just there. Let, let go. Let go. a lot of tears. I don't like platforming. Hello! So, what is that? Oh, a clue! Looks like it's been ripped off from a piece of clothing or accessory. Yay! Knowledge! Okay, do I... Is that it? Maybe I can talk to you? What is this? Just jumped off, sir. 
I can't use doors. Now I need, I have no other lead. The vent, the vent thing. There was a vent in Vigilante. Hmm. Vent in Vigilante. Ooh, more rat time. Can I phase to, okay. It's kind of, uh, there we go. Trap, <gasps> I found a clue and I wasn't even looking for it. Big shark shards of a big flower pot from our store looks recent considering some of their shards still have dirt and tulips leaves attached to them. More knowledge! And I wasn't expect- Ooh, what did I see over there? Eh, nothing. It's probably nothing. Okay, can I let go? Awesome! Um, that's two clues. I need three more. Maybe I can get this done in one video. Mm. Oh, there's blood. Maybe I should talk to these people. So. Oh, who the? Who are you? What are you? Fine, I'm gonna possess somebody. Hold on. <sighs> Who's there? Not some cop, I hope. Let me take a good whiff. You don't smell like a cop, who are you? I guess I don't care as long as you're not a cop, your friend. <laughs> What's your uh, business? Doesn't my reputation precede me? In the eyes of the law, my name is Vincent the Vigilante Vent Repair Man. <laughs> no, it's not my birth name, it's what I've become. <laughs> Chosen to become. <laughs> My mission is to improve, <laughs> improve the air quality of Kauai. What? People are breathing all the time here. It's polluting the air like crazy. That's why I only breathe when I really need to. <laughs> I'm fixing all the air vents around town to purify the air, but they're kind of sucky. I have to fix them all the time, too often to plan appointments. But people don't seem to understand. <laughs> they seem to be a fan of unplanned maintenance work on their houses. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it's free, but no. I <laughs> don't know. Even if someone came in and was like, I'm going to fix your walls and like repaint and decorate. I'd be like, who are you? Why are you in my house? <laughs> I mean, it'd be nice afterwards, but at the moment, I'd be terrified. Long story short, I'm on the run from the law. <laughs> so stupid. What do you know about this? What's your business? Hey, that looks familiar. Don't tell me. Oh no, my cape has been ripped. <gasps> Clue. This is truly awful. I've never been the same. I'll never look as funky fresh as I did before. Where was this? What? It was on the roof of a crime scene? Hey now, I know this isn't looking good for poor old Vincey boy, but I promise it wasn't me. Did one of your vents malfunction or something and kill me? Sure, yes, I was near the crime scene last night, but, but I was only fixing the air vent on the roof. I didn't have nothing to do with the murder. I swear on my very honor as a vent repairman. Well, I trust you because everyone knows vent repairmen have a lot of honor. So that's interesting. I'm guessing I can't go over here. Nope. Okay. Wait. <laughs> he's he's, <laughs> he's staked out right next to his wanted poster. <laughs> What's that? Is that like a donut? Looks like donut. Okay. So that's why the vents. Okay. You bloody man, you are suspect. Talk to me. No, I keep pressing the wrong buttons. Bloody man, talk to this man. The only one I like to speak to is Annie, the handyman. Okay, so I need that. So I'm just gonna leave you wondering why you're over here. 
Uh, I have no. I don't care for the mortal world anymore. I just want to avenge my murder. Hello. So I'm guessing you're the handy man. What is your name? Oh, you're Sally. Okay. You have a lot of knife tattoos. Okay. Well, 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 if it isn't Annie the Handyman. I see you're not T-posing anymore, unlike the bones in my steaks. Don't tell me you need to borrow my tools again. These people. Who are you? As a person who stands in front of my shop window almost daily, and you barely even come inside to talk to me. Is there something I'm not aware of, Annie? Then again, someone your size overlooks the letters of my logo fairly easily. Just this once, I'll formally introduce myself to you. Sarah Stabin Sally Sharples. At your service, if I feel like it. Wow, you got a lot of attitude there, Sally. Do you know anything about Julia's murder? Who? The flower girl? Which one again? Never mind. How should I know? The only thing I put my knife in is meat. Well, humans have meat. <laughs> or used to since I lost it somewhere. Oh. I didn't do it if that's what you're thinking. As much as I hate people, I'm still stabbing Sally, not killing Sally. That is very much connected. I might tell you more once I get my favorite knife back. Okay. Apology? I didn't apologize to you. I didn't apologize to people. <laughs> Let's see. There's probably her knife somewhere around here, right? Where would it be? Party? Oh, maybe I should have talked to that man. There's really not that many people around here, so it's not too much of a bother. Oh, isn't this the twins? Hey, Twimmy Nimi boy. <laughs> Twimmy Nimi boy. Not gonna talk. Nope. Okay. So I figured out that you can use these little guys, these birdies, to fly on these vents. Or I'm not really sure where I'm supposed. Oh, okay. I keep pressing that button wrong. No, is the birds one? Oh, never mind. Maybe I do. Probably do. Okay, so I have to go over there. Oh, I have to go up. I see. So, I have a nice fly over here. Touchdown. And then come over here. That bird just died. It's okay. And I need to go over here. I'm still really not good at this. And there. And then, voila! Ah! What is up here? Was there any? any oh, oh, oh! N is that knife? Uh, no, that's bread. Um. Uh, is there? Was there any point in coming up here? Oh, why is it glitchy? Maybe. Oh, I got the knife. Okay, blade knife, still sharp as a red liquid on it. That could be blood. No fingerprints. Righty dandy. Now I need to get the handyman and then talk to that woman, Sally. Hello. I forget her voice. <laughs> I have like the memory of a gnat. Well, 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 if it isn't Annie, the handyman. So she won't say anything. Yeah. So I guess you actually don't have to give it to her. Oh, N Sally, I don't want to talk to you anymore. You useless to me. Good. So I have two more, and there's more vents. So I just need another burden. Bird, come over here, bird. I won't hurt you. Okay. And Q. Oh. 
Oh, this one doesn't go that far, maybe. Why did the other one go? Uh, I guess it's just to teach you, maybe. Yeah, the other one went up higher, so maybe I don't need to use those. Hmm. Ah, uh, there's one right here. I don't probably need to use this one either. Oh, that went high, but that's just the same thing. There's one over there. So this one doesn't go that high. Oh, there's bird poop over there, maybe? That usually signals you need to be over there. How do I... Is that bird poop? It looks like bird poop. Nope, that's just light. And bird poop, light, all it's the same thing. Oh, there's a vent here. I didn't even notice that. Hmm, suspicious. Was there a vent up there? I don't think so, but still. Suspicious. Okay, stop making the wind noise. And now I'm back on the hunt for another. Wait, how many clues? Yeah, two more clues. break time. Hmm. There's no one really blocking any way, so I don't really know what the rat scary thing is going to be. But I got achievements. What? I don't see anything here. Okay, cause oh, this. What was that? Did I kill her? What? Okay. How is that useful? Um, can I scare this person? He has no fear. I mean, he lives in vents, so he shouldn't have any fear. Can I? <laughs> I don't. Ow. I, d I don't know what to do anymore. Okay. Is there any other ones I missed? I don't really know. A uh, vase in the. So, I still can't find the last two clues. I've been recording for a little while now, and I honestly don't know where they are. So I'm probably going to come back later with a fresh brain and figure it out. So this video is going to be split into two parts. <laughs> but the last part should be pretty quick. But anyway, thanks for watching. Have a good one. Bye.